Talking of good, talking of bad, Bayern Munich, meanwhile, are beaten at home by Dortmund 2-0. Um, if they hadn't conceded the title yet, surely this seals it. Yeah, I think psychologically, mentally, they'd won three games on the span. They scored eight goals against Muppet teams. And then, look, they Why played. have they not sacked Tuchel? They should have sacked him after the Freiburg game when he's laughing and joking with some of the Freiburg I, stuff. I mean, they have essentially sacked him. He's a zombie coach through the end of the season. Sacked him um, properly. I think, I think I think he should have gone to a caretaker. Same. I think they still got it in his head that because Tuchel won the Champions League, until we get knocked out from the Champions League, he's going to stick, stick around. Um... I thought this was really, really disappointing. Um, Musiala had a rough game, but also he can't be your only creative force. Harry Kane missed a couple, missed a couple headers. But actually, from a player's point of view, are you going to be really playing for this manager that you know are not going, is not going to be there? No, it's, a, it's not. Not only do you know he's not going to be there, you know oh, that gone. your bosses think he's not good enough. Yeah, <laughs> and exactly. But that's that's, <laughs> that's a tough point, and and I think it's on the players. But on Borussia Dortmund, I thought they sat deep. They countered. They did really well. Um, Nicholas Fulkrug. Uh, uh, Fulkrug Brent to Adeyemi for the first goal. Bit special. Um, and my man Ian Matson again. Oh. What a player. So as we mentioned Liverpool and Bayern, let's talk Xabi Alonso. What do you make of him announcing that he will stay at Bayer Leverkusen for one more season? Obviously, I think it's an open secret. Liverpool and Bayern have job offers mm -hmm. and job openings. Two of his previous clubs. Mm -hmm. Stinks of Real Madrid to me. Oh my God! No. Why? 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 Why don't you, Why don't you like that? Okay, so don't you think he's all, staying at Leverkusen for one more year out of a little bit of loyalty, which I quite like? Uh -huh. But don't you think he's got an right. eye on potential Real Madrid? Well, he can have eyes wherever he wants. I mean, yeah. first of all, he has nine Real Madrid. He has nine Liverpool. He has a line. But Liverpool Bob job Madrid. and Bayern job won't be there in a year's time. You wouldn't have thought. Right. Will the Real Madrid job be there in a year's Maybe. time? Maybe. Maybe, maybe not. Well, what if Liverpool appoint Alan Pardew and <laughs> it all goes, what, what, I mean, I actually, I wrote a whole column about this. I think this is a sign of humility and it's a sign of not just loyalty, but humility. He knows, he said, this is his first full season as a manager. Yeah. He knows he's got a ton to learn. He's got a, he knows he's got a lot to grow. People are saying, oh, he already has a deal with Real Madrid through 2025. I don't like, think there's a deal there. Hey, Carlo Ancelotti has a deal through 2026, by the way, right? So we'd have to wait two years, right? Unless they sack What's Ancelotti. happened to the Brazil job then? Is that, is that far gone? I thought that was nearly done. No, no, no. That's, that, 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 he said he was going to stay if Real Madrid offered him a job and Real Madrid okay. um, offered him a job. Um, Champions League, who knows what happened? They, they, Bayer Leverkusen of the fourth highest wage bill in the Bundesliga, right? Mm. They could finish third next season, maybe you go out in the round of 16 of the Champions League and then look, that Real Madrid job, no longer there, right? I get it. I, I love the fact that he knows he needs to learn and grow to be ready to manage a club like Liverpool or Bayern or Real Madrid. And, and I think people should, I mean, all conspiratorial and stupid about it, people should just, I think, just go and recognize that. Yeah. There no. is managers do develop loyalty towards players, right? Yes. Sometimes, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. There is such I, a thing. I, oh, I, I, he's on pace for a record-setting season. Absolutely, I admire him for staying at Leverkusen. I really, really do. I think it's a great move from him. Uh, more Alonso, uh, a late winner from Patrick Schick, gives them a two-one win over Hoffenheim. Could they win this by mid-April? Yeah, I mean they could win this. I think in two weeks' time, if Bayern drop more points, um, they have a thirteen-point lead with seven games to go. That's finished. Um, they haven't finished. lost. They haven't lost a game all season, Dom. What do you want me to say? They have not lost a game all season. I've seen them twice against Karabag, Leverkusen. And they were rubbish. No, no, no. They were 2 0 down, I think, with yeah, yeah, five yeah. minutes ago. Yeah, drew 2 no. 2. The next game they played, 2 0 down, 1 3. Yeah, but saying, in this game, they weren't lucky. They, the, the winner may have come late. And by the way, shout out to Patrick Schick because he's not the starting center forward. As you know, Victor Boniface yeah. has been out forever. Um, Oh, my point, but, my point but they was... they dominated. Yeah, my point was they're getting the job done. They've got, they've got belief, haven't they? They create so many chances. Yeah. And it's just a tremendous job. Mm -hmm.